Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So we have two new hidden features that have been spotted in yesterday's Dev and Canary channel build 26052. And both of these hidden features have once again been spotted by Phantom Ocean 3 over on X. Now, a quick recap, hidden features are code that Microsoft could be testing internally. And as we have seen on the channel and even earlier today, some of these hidden features can even roll out for official testing and even make their way into the stable version eventually. Now, as many of you may know, hidden features in most cases can be enabled with the third party app called Valve Tool. And the first of uh, two is a new feature called Speak For Me, which is an accessibility feature, which is found now as a hidden feature in build uh, 26052 on the accessibility page right here at the bottom. Speak For Me, and when you click on that, you can see that it has a new Speak For Me page, and when the feature is toggled on, basically, um, it'll let you type what you want to say and have it spoken aloud. So in the description here, it says press the Windows logo key and Control and T to turn Speak For Me on and off. So obviously you can toggle that off and on manually or you can use the keyboard shortcut. And the description here reads, with the help of Speak For Me, you can create your own voice avatar or preserve your own voice to communicate with others, whether in online meetings or in person conversation so that's going to be an interesting one to watch but as i say when there are accessibility accessibility features made available in operating systems i do think that is always a step in the right direction and then the second um, new feature and for this we're going to head over to a gif provided by phantom ocean 3 and this is a bit of a ui tweak where um um microsoft seems to be working on modernized taskbar thumbnails that's hidden in build 26052. And this is obviously not how your animations work in the stable version currently of Windows 11. So it is expected that there's a possibility that we could be getting a more modernized taskbar thumbnail um, animations um, in future builds of Windows. But I must be honest, animations are not something I really use and I always toggle that setting off in Windows because I do feel... Um, Especially on a low-budget machine, I do feel that it does use a little bit more system resources. And I personally don't like all the animations. I like it when something just opens and closes in the quickest and shortest way uh, possible. But nonetheless, if you are into animations, this may be something you may be interested in. And um, both these features, as mentioned, spotted by Phantom Ocean 3 over on X. And that was um, these were both spotted in the latest Canary and Def Channel build 26052. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.